Soul Calibur is why you got the Genesis? Are you sure you don't have the wrong console? Do you mean Dreamcast? I think you mean Dreamcast. Because Soul Calibur was my favorite, or is my favorite, fighting game. And I had a Dreamcast with Soul Calibur. But I also had a Genesis. And that was a much older console. Way before Soul Calibur's time. Yeah, yeah, Dreamcast. Yeah, okay, good. Ow! Ow again! How dare you make me bleed my own blood? <laughs> I like the shot with this. All right. Well, well, well. I guess we don't do anything with that. Hey, Fire of Moon. What do we got? Ah, okay. That's what we needed. Now we can get more heals. Hello. I like, I like having the halberd for that range option, you know, when you need it. Oh, come on. What? All right, we got a little house, a little cottage over here. Yeah, Dungeon and Nail book is on Humble, Mon uh, Humble Monthly. Pretty cool. Should have some copies in the vault uh, at some point when we do an update. Oh, we need a tool for this too. So those are, we need the shortcut tool. So you were willing to, how did you, what did you feel about, uh, the whole Vegas, uh, quests in, uh, Horizon? He looks pissed. Vegas Quest your favorite? I think they were mine too. Oh 
my god, you gave me a heart attack, you slippery snake. Jesus Christmas. My goodness. Falchion and Saber. Hold on. Blade Tornado. By using the Sword and Falchion in combination, Aegis can perform a spinning attack that delivers a flurry of hits. Oh, it's medium weight. Um, I wonder how weight what weight does for you. This is more power, but it does have some agility. Let's try this. I like that. What did they come out of her wrists? Pretty neat. All right, let's try this out. This is your favorite weapon, Sparkwood? I like it so far. Of course, it's more power based. Is there a way to like respec uh, your stats like that you've upgraded? Just in case we decide to go more of a power build at some point. Not in the beta, okay. Didn't you have slottable mods that gave you stats? Yeah, right here. What about it? You're not sure if this came up when you played Forbidden West, but apparently the voice actor who plays Kotalo also plays Sekiro, really? Did your main character talk in that? I don't, I don't recall. I don't recall. Yeah. No, to me, he's, to me, he's Charles. That would be your minor respec? No, that's just equipment. Because this, uh, slightly reduces internal damage caused by rapid cooling. It's like, it's not the same. It's not what I'm talking about. Blocked. It's funny because they both have mechanical arms. True. All right. We reached the banks of sea. In the queen's drawing room, take a boat to Paris. We've made it. This boat will take me to Paris. Hello. Um, I need... I need help. Uh, help? Techno Nude says, so far, Bog has played two games I'm not interested in? What do you mean? Only two? I meant to say now. I really want to play this and the game from yesterday. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> yeah, good, good releases this week. 
especially if you like uh, like steampunk stuff. Oh shit, I didn't want to do that. I've got these slow heal over times. Oh, <laughs> I set him up. I was in midair going, no. Batter up. When he wants to, he's pretty spry. Uh. Techno Nudes typo has gotten like three views. I know. Yeah, that's true. All right. Well, that's far away. Let's sit our butt down here. And let's upgrade number of doses, please. Thank you. How the hell do I get back? Now I'm trying to get back before the fool done runs out. I'll be giving it my bestest, but nothing's going to stop us at divine intervention. I guess and it's again my turn to win some or learn some. So I no hesitate no more. All right. You, 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 you're going to be kissing Kansas real soon. Just get on the boat. No iframes? I don't know what this is, but I don't want to be anywhere near you. Get away! 
we go. Nice. Brain 2 stable charging module and a module key. Nice. We did it. I guess that's the second boss. Hey, it's Moogletart. Hey, it's Moogletart. Hey, it's... What's going on? How you doing? This seems like a Moogletart game. Right? Souls-like. Automatons. It's all good. All right. What do we What do we got? Grade 2. Why can't I use it? This moderately increases balance during charged attacks. I guess I have to upgrade a slot before I can use the level 2 thing in it. I, that's what I said earlier. It reminds you of the marionette, mo marionette monsters in Guild Wars 2. Totally. 100%. The Queen's Jubilee. Alright, so that's blocked. Alright, I think uh, I think we're done with this zone. We're going to be taking this boat here. Travel to Paris. I'm probably going to take a quick break. Now that Moogle Tart's here, it's a good time for a break. Now I'm gonna take a quick break before we go to Paris, I think. This boat will take me to Paris. <laughs> I know. Yeah. Let me just destroy these barrels. Okay, I can't go back in there because I don't have the thing. I guess you can come back to these zones once you get a tool. I guess so. What's up? What's up? I got my peanut butter and jelly sandwich. I got some watermelon. Watermelon. What are you guys having for uh, lunch, dinner, or breakfast the next day? Over pasta. Nice. A Safeway calzone. It's meh. I find a lot of calzones just have too much cheese. And I know it kind of, it's kind of like the point, but just too much for me. Oh, diced deceased cow boiled in flavored water, Golomancy? Oh, you mean like a beef stew? Hmm. You made it sound totally not good, but yeah. Sounds like what I had for breakfast. This for breakfast I had uh, unfertilized chicken embryos all mixed together. Yeah. allowed to go over here disallowed no and I bet jumping in the water is death oh there's somebody over here oh no it's just that's a dead guy but I got his loot frost grenades oh sugar I had, oh my god, all my souls. Can I get those again? You better let me get my stuff. Where's my stuff? Didn't I have a whole bunch of stuff? Your suspicion was right. He just does not swim. He just does not swim. But did I really lose? How much? Did I have a couple thousand? I think I had a couple thousand. Um, 
It's on the other side behind the tree, is it? Oh, you're right. How am I going to get that, though? Like that. Yes! Problem solved. Thank you. I don't know how you saw that. <clears throat> I was like, that's my, that's my boss souls. Everybody's talking about cheese. Everyone, the hairs on the back of Cheese Wiz's neck are standing up. People keep talking about me. Eyes like a hawk, ears like a wolf, a brave star. Somebody help us, we want cheese. Oh, you have the BTTV highlight, so it always lights up when someone mentions cheese. How funny. That's hilarious. Yeah, that would... You know what? I, uh, I have the same thing, but people don't often talk about bogs when they're not referencing me direct. Or frost grenades. Alright. Immobilization. Aegis's light weapons are able to inflict immobilization damage as shown in the immobilization gauge. When the gauge is filled, the enemy is temporarily immobilized, leaving them open to a critical hit. R1 or R2. Oh, I never noticed that. Four fifty PM. Four fifty? Yeah. Okay. I'll leave this open. Okay. Sounds good. Oh, uh, robot doggies. Bogs can be kind of cheese-like. I can be very cheesy. That's for sure. You remember having to put in a ton of Marvel character names into the highlight thing when you had your front page month? It was the same time Endgame came out and we had to keep on spoiler duty? How funny. Um, all right, let's level up. I wonder if I should save up. I'm going to save that key for now. I don't even have a third module level one module that I can put in. Yeah, I don't know which, um, <clears throat> which weapon I'm going to be focusing on. A lot of cool weapons already. All right, so this is power. Oh, this so this is more agility. So I could do could do the fans and the halberd. I guess we'll stick to agility for now. And when I get more, I'll upgrade a weapon. What are they telling me to do here? Why is this blue? Um, blue, double dee, blue to die, double dee, double die, double dee, blue to die. How difficult has this game been so far? Oh, we've only beaten two bosses. Uh, we've died 
a bunch of times. It's not it's not overly difficult, but they do have um they do have difficulty settings. You can go into assist mode and reduce your damage. You can make it so you don't lose your souls after death. Um endurance regen speed, you can make that go faster. Um you can also make it so that you uh can cool down easier and get your endurance back faster. Yeah. So, if you're intimidated by Souls games, I would, uh, but otherwise you you like everything you're seeing, then give it a try. So you can tweak it. Is this where I came from? Yeah, it's totally where you came from. You dip. Call me a dip. You're a dip. All right. Can't go this way. You found a mod for Mortal Shell to get rid of that vignette effect. Hopefully I can get back into it with that mod in place. Nice. I never noticed that when I was playing. Which is probably good. Oh crap, I got a water flask. Oh, nice little tail whap. What are you playing? Steel Rising. Uh Sorry, with like the fans. Like, so you'd like this. First of all, there's my character. Very cool. Um, and I'm, oh, that's nice. And I can bring out the fans nice. as a shield. You were in bed when I was looking for a snack last night. Yes. And I'm like, all those messed up cookies, right? Because there was a bunch. There's a whole bunch of messed. There's up. a whole bunch of like reject cookies. Like, did she throw them away? Never. I was so mad. I was like, because wow. I looked everywhere. I'm like, I can't find. Did you find them? I finally, I was, I gave up, and I'm yeah. like, all right, what else am I gonna have for a snack? And then I'm like, these cookie trays that are stacked on the, the oven. Like Look, a little bit I'm like, I thought there was just dishes. Like there was a pile of dishes. No. And I, I'm like, I peeked under. I'm like, oh, there's a whole bunch of cookie rejects yeah, under I was, here. I was, uh, I was way too <laughs> tired to try to like put it away. I wasn't feeling too, too good. So I, uh, I said, you know what? I'm just going to put one baking sheet on top of the other and that'll be protection. Cookie rejects are great. How was it? Was it, was it good? Try both. A little bit of both, right? I like the uh, the non chocolate chip. Oh, you did. Hmm, I'm glad. Yeah, what kind? There was a chocolate chip, and then what else? It's a snickerdoodle cookie butter. Snick snickerdoodle cookie butter. Snickerdoodle. Say that ten times fast. Snickerdoodle cookie cut. What? <laughs> snickerdoodle cookie butter. Snicker. Wow. Snickerdoodle cookie butter. Snickle. I can't do that more than once. Snickerdoodle cookie butter. Snicker. Nope. That's it. What? You did that really good. Snicker doodle cookie butter. Snicker doodle cookie butter. Snicker burger 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 burger. Oh God! You messed up. Yeah, and I don't even have the right weapon. Now. So, so the reason we call them or I call them reject cookies is because I I put too many on the pan while they were baking. And they kind of morphed into each other. So they were uh, not very pleasant on the eyes. That's why I call them. Actually, 
actually, it's funny that you say that. Sell them as a um, mystery reject box. That'd be funny as hell. I actually was planning on having a, um, a smaller option where it was like, just pay shipping and you get the reject. So I hope they can hear you. It's loud in here. Sorry. I was thinking those could work. It's loud in this combat world. Just pay shipping and you can get some reject cookies. Just pay shipping? Yeah, I think so. No. We'll see. Got to charge. A couple bucks. We'll see. You will pay full price for the reject cookies. Seven. <laughs> I, now I kind of want to get you guys two cookies to show you like what a reject The reject cookies are great. They're huge. <laughs> they're, they're like bigger than normal cookies. They're better. No, we're sick. Free. She's like, 